Good day everyone. Welcome to Teacher Julie Channel. Hello everyone. We have our new lesson in Science 7 which is all about exploring the microscopic world of cells. This will be the second quarter topic and learning competency number 2. This lesson is under the Matatag curriculum. For the objectives, by the end of the lesson, 80% of the learners will be able to First is to identify and describe the major organelles of the plant or animal cell including the cell membrane, nucleus, cytoplasm, mitochondria, chloroplast, and ribosomes and to demonstrate the proper microscope handling and slide preparation techniques. And the last one is to appreciate the complexity and diversity of cellular structure by answering the reflection of learning. In activating the prior knowledge, for the short review, the students will complete the words below by filling in the missing letters. Developing and deepening of understanding, the following are the organelles, their description, function, and classification. The first organelle is the cell wall. It is a rigid, tough, made of cellulose. The function of this is to protect and to support the cell, and it is only present in the plant cell. Another organelle is the cytoplasm. It is a jelly-like substance that contains the organelles. The function of this is pads and supports the organelles inside the cell. And it is present in both animal and plant cell. Another organelle is the nucleus. It is a dense, ball-shaped structure and it contains DNA. The function of this is to control all the cell's activity and it is present in both animal and plant cell. 
Another organelle is the endoplasmic reticulum. It is a clear tubular system of tunnels throughout the cell. The function of this is to transport materials like proteins around the cell and it is present in both animal and plant cell. Another organelle is the ribosome. It is a small spix made of RNA and it is found in cytoplasm or on the endoplasmic reticulum. The function of this is to make proteins. It is present in both animal and plant cell. Another organelle is the mitochondria. The location is in the cytoplasm and it has a bean shape. The function of this is to supply energy or ATP for the cell through the cell respiration by using glucose and oxygen, and it is present in both animal and plant cell. Another organelle is the vacuole. It is a large open storage area, smaller in animal cells. The function of this is storage tank for food, water, or waste or enzymes, and it is present in both animal and plant cell. Another organelle is what we call the chloroplast. It is a green structure that contains the chlorophyll. The function of this is to capture sunlight and uses it to produce food through photosynthesis, and it is only present in plant cell. Another organelle is the Golgi body. It has a small bags with tube connecting to the other organelle. The function of this is packages and secretes protein for use in and out of the cell. And it is present in both animal and plant cell. The following are the demonstrating of microscope handling. The first one is carrying the microscope. So all you have to do is to grab the microscope by the arm or the base and not in the eyepiece. And then hold the microscope close to your body for stability. And avoid swinging or jerking the microscope as you carry it. And set the microscope down gently on a stable and level surface. Another way of demonstrating microscope handling is by adjusting the microscope. So start with the lowest power objective lens, for example, the 4 times or the 10 times, and use the course adjustment knob to quickly bring the stage into focus. And then switch to the fine adjustment knob to refine the focus. Then rotate the nose piece to change the objective lenses, being carefully not to hit the slide. And then adjust the interpolillary distance of the eyepieces to match your eyes. Another ways of demonstrating microscope handling is by focusing the microscope. So all you have to do is to place the prepared slide on the stage and secure it with the stage clips and then start with the lowest power objectives and bring the specimen into the view and then use the course adjustment knob to get a rough focus and then switch to the fine adjustment knob to sharpen the image. Make small incremental turns of the fine adjustment until the specimen is in clear focus. For the work example, we have the picture analysis. This is the plant and animal cell. So the students will collaboratively list down the difference between the plants and animal cells.